guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Maggie and I would love if you guys subscribed just to join our little family, that would mean so much to me. But today's video is a long awaited, kind of cumulative fall clothing haul. All these items I bought during the past couple of weeks to the past month and I've just been waiting up because you guys really liked my back to school try on clothing haul with like everything that I bought. So today I'm just gonna be showing you everything I have from all of these different stores. I shopped at Revolve, I shopped at Free People, um, Forever 21, Urban Outfitters, Sephora, all my favorite stores and I'll have all of these items linked down below for you guys so you can check them out if you want to and without further ado let's get started okay I don't even know which store to start off with I'm gonna try to keep it in order and like go by store just to be like more organized and help you guys out like in the long run if you guys are looking for some of these items but I would recommend grab a snack grab a drink get comfortable this is going to be a long 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 haul and I'm so excited to show you guys everything so I guess today we will start off with jeans and if you guys watch my videos and know me, you guys know that I hate jeans. I can never find any that fit me right just because I have more of like an athletic build. So my legs and my butt just don't fit into jeans that well because like they have to fit my waist and then my legs and butt all together, but usually it doesn't work that way. Um, so if you are a girl, you know like the struggle of finding a good pair of jeans. So I have four pairs of jeans right here, surprise, surprise, of all of my favorites that I've been wearing that I recently just got. And the first pair I'm gonna talk about are these Levi's. They are just these light washed, distressed, high-waisted mom jeans. And these are actually customized to my body type by Allie Grace. So if you go on Instagram and just type in shop Allie Grace, I'll have her Instagram link down below. Um, you can send her your like measurements and everything and she will find a perfect pair of Levi's for you, whether it's shorts or jeans. I actually have a pair of shorts from her and also these jeans right here, but they just fit me so well because Levi's, like you can't really go by size. It kind of is all different since they're so vintage and they're, they just sell them at different places and I feel like the measurements are all like crazy, but these ones honestly fit me so well. They really suck me into my waist and they're loose and like baggy on my legs and my knees, which is really, really hard to find for me. So if you guys are looking for like a custom pair of Levi's, definitely reach out to her on Instagram and she will quote me with a price and like give her your measurements and she will find a perfect pair of jeans for you. And the next pair of jeans are actually from Abercrombie and I got a pair from there a year ago and they fit me so well. I haven't been able to find a pair of jeans like that anywhere other than there and they're called the Annie Girlfriend Jean and I got them in like a light wash with rips and a lot of you guys have been asking me on Instagram where they're from. They're from Abercrombie because literally the Levi's and my light wash Abercrombie jeans were the only two pairs of jeans I owned so I would wear them all the time. But recently I just went online on Abercrombie.com and I looked up the Annie jean just because I was like, you know what? I wonder if they like brought them back this year because of the fall and whatnot. So I ended up finding them and they have so many different colors and they were on sale for $44. So I picked up three pairs and the first pair I got are just these kind of medium wash distressed pair and they have this little distressed detailing on the bottom. They're just really high waisted and fit really nicely and like suck you in. And they are like a girlfriendy mom jean so they're not as loose, they kind of just like are really high-waisted and looser around like your calf area but tight on your thighs which I just think adds like a more feminine look so I the first pair I got are these medium wash ones and then the next pair I got are these really really distressed medium wash ones so they just have the rips all down the front and then the bottoms are kind of like raw edge raw cut and this is what the back looks like they're just plain distressed medium wash jeans and then the third pair that I got are really, really cool because they're more of a lighter wash, but what I love about them is that they have a zipper all up the side and they have some distressed detailing at the bottom. But I just thought that the zipper just added a really, really nice touch to the jean. It just adds something a little bit extra in case you want to wear like a plain bodysuit with it and like a plain black pair of booties. The rip up the side just adds so much detail and like kind of a lot of character to your jean. I just really liked it and I thought it was really different and for $44, I couldn't go wrong had to buy three pairs at once because honestly buying those jeans all at once They also had a sale going on if you spent hundred dollars or more and then I think it gave you like 15% off So it ended up being like hundred dollars for three pairs of jeans Which usually isn't the case if you go to a regular store like if you go to urban you're buying one pair of jeans for like 80 90 dollars or even full price at Abercrombie So I just think that it definitely this is like that life hack of fall 2018 for jeans is to buy them from Abercrombie. 
And next we are going to go into all the things that I got from Urban. I only picked up a few things, which is weird for me this month because usually I go crazy at Urban during the fall. Um, but the first thing that I got is this little quarter zip sweater type thing. And it's really, really soft and it's kind of thin. It's just this heathered gray. And I got this in a size small and the neck is just this maroon stripe detailing with a little zipper. I really like this because you guys know I dress comfy a lot, so I just thought that this was super cute just to wear like underneath a leather jacket or something during the fall, but I love this. And then the next item I got from Urban is this seamless bodycon dress, and this is by their Out From Underline, and I got this in a size medium, and it fits really, really nicely, and I feel like this would look super cute with like a pair of Doc Martens and like an oversized jacket during the fall. Just a plain black seamless bodycon I think everybody should have in their closet. It's just a really nice staple to have. You can like dress it so many different ways, pair it with so many different like items and like wear it with different outfits, and I just think that it's super perfect. And I honestly haven't been able to find like a seamless bodycon dress that was straight across that fit me right, but this one from Urban really, really fits well, and I really like it. And then the last item I got, actually Emma ordered these and they ended up not fitting her so I just paid her back for them but they're just these gray comfy champion shorts and I know that Emma ordered these off of Dote. If you guys don't know what Dote is, it is a app where you can order literally anything you want all at once. You can like order stuff from Urban, Free People, um, Revolve, Nasty Gal, all those stores, put them all in your shopping cart and have kind of like a one-click checkout. You can use my code Maggie for a $5 gift card just in case you guys like any of these items. You can find all of them on the Dote app, but Emma ordered these and they're a size small and they ended up not fitting her. So they ended up fitting me, so I bought them off of her. Just super cute, plain, gray, comfy champion shorts. And these next two items I ordered off of Revolve on Dote, and this is the first item right here. It's just this really big pink turtleneck comfy slouchy sweater, and I got it in a medium just because I wanted it more oversized, which I should have got a small because I think here in New England it's a little bit too cold for that right now. I'm gonna have to like go to LA or somewhere warmer in order to wear this, but I just think that it looks super cute. If you are from a place where it's warmer during the fall, you definitely could get away with wearing a cute pair of shorts like with this and a pair of boots. I just think that's super cute. Again, I got it in a size medium and it's by the brand One Teaspoon. Let me just like triple check to make sure. Yeah, One Teaspoon. But it's really, really cute and I think that this color is like so different. And I don't know, I just thought that it was like something funky. I haven't worn it yet and I'm gonna find the perfect time to wear it, but yeah. <laughs> Okay, this next item I have been eyeing for the longest time ever. I've been wanting these shoes for so, so long. I think I've been looking at them honestly since like April, but they are just by the brand Ray. I think that's upside down. Um, by the brand Ray, and I got them on Revolve. They're the most gorgeous pair of heels in the whole entire world. They were a bit pricey like they actually were really expensive they were $168 and for a pair of heels like I really thought about it and I couldn't stop thinking about it every single time I would go on dope to shop I would be like I want these heels so bad so I just did it one day they were on sale and I bought them and this is just what they look like they are these black suede chunky heels with this like wooden block heel and it's just like platform like that, but I just think that these are the most gorgeous heels in the whole entire world. I'm so obsessed with them. And I feel like they literally go with anything and they're just so timeless that they won't go out of style. And I just really love them. And I got them in a size nine, but yeah, that was definitely like the one item that I had been eyeing for the longest time and just like saved up for. And I'm really excited to wear them. I'm so happy that I got them. I know that they're gonna look perfect with literally anything. You can wear them with like, shorts honestly and like a big oversized shirt you can wear them with jeans you can wear them with a skirt you can wear them with a dress you can wear them so many different ways i just think that they're a perfect staple to have and yeah and this next store is totally random but i got a few items actually from target i went in there to get a calculator for my finance class actually and i came out with three items actually the first one is these earrings right here they're just these really really chunky hoops they were only six dollars they're amazing 
I love them. They go great with everything that you own. You can wear them so many different ways. I just feel like they're really just like a classic piece and they look really good on and you guys have been asking me like crazy where they're from but I kind of just waited to say it until I did this haul just because they're the most amazing earrings in the whole entire world. And then the second item I got is this Rolling Stones t-shirt and I think it was like 10 bucks or something. It was really cheap and I know if you go to Urban these t-shirts are like $40, $50. So I just picked this one up. It has kind of like a bleached paint splatter like detailing to it um but it's just like this black oversized t-shirt i got it in size large just to wear it oversized or even like just dress it and cut it if i ever wanted to but i just feel like it looks super um like trendy with a front tuck and two pair of shorts or like boyfriend jeans something like that i just think that band tees are really in right now not that i listen to the rolling stones i don't even think i know one song by them but i just think that it's like really trendy and cute and it was super cheap so the first item i got was this and then next I got this sweatshirt. It is this royal blue cropped hoodie. And I think it's super cute just to have and like throw on during the day. You can never go wrong with wearing a crop hoodie and I love this color. I used to wear this sweatshirt that was my mom's and it was from her yoga studio. And it had like the yoga studio down the arm and like on the back. And I've worn it in a couple videos before and you guys are like, oh my god, I love that sweatshirt. Like where is it from? And this one reminds me of it, but honestly like this one's cropped. I like this one so much more. It has no writing on it and it's just from Target. It is a size small. And next, I got some items from Lulu, and the first one is this sports bra. It's a heathered gray color, and it's one of the longer ones that go down and like, go on, like kind of like at your rib cage. It has this detailing in the back, these little like straps. I don't know what the name of this one is called, but I got it in size six. I really like it because you guys know when I work out, I don't like to wear a shirt. I just like to wear like a long sports bra. So I picked up this one just because I'm always working out. You guys know I go to Soul Cycle a lot. I'm always going to the gym. So I just decided to get another sports bra just because I don't have one in this color. I really like the longness of them. They always sell out super fast. So when I see any sports bra like sports bras like this, I try to just pick them up when I see them. And then this next item you guys have been messaging me about like crazy also. And I got another scuba hoodie from Lululemon. I used to wear these like in high school when I was younger and I just feel like I always got like my true size I would always get a four and they always just would be like super uncomfortable and tight so I got a size six in this one and it is so comfortable plus this color I've never seen before and it is just the softest most comfortable gray in the whole entire world but I love this sweatshirt so much just wear it with a pair of joggers and it's so comfy i think i wore it for like two weeks straight after i got it but yeah this is just the lululemon scuba hoodie and next i just picked up some items from free people the first thing is this little scrunchie i used to wear this before i cut my hair as short as i have it now but it looks really cute when you put like a bun on the top of your head and then just have these two little like pieces sticking out i just think it's super cute so i'm gonna put this actually no i'm not gonna put it on my wrist <laughs> um but the next thing i got i saw these pants in the store and i was like oh my god i need them so bad so i got these ones to start and they are just these green really high-waisted super long and flowy sweatpants and i got them in a size small and they are kind of long and a little bit big on my waist like i know that if i got a size extra small they just would fit me so much better because i feel like free people runs big but i couldn't leave the store without them and the girl was like are you sure you don't want to order them in an extra small i was like honestly these pants are so flattering and so cute i'm just gonna go home and order a pair an extra small like in a different color so i picked up another pair of the sweatpants in this really soft gray color and i got these ones in the extra small and they just fit so much better they are like really snug on my waist and they are the perfect length again they just have this like really long like flared out leg and i'm so obsessed with these sweatpants i know they come in a few other different colors too if you guys don't like these colors but i just think they're amazing and honestly i wear mine with my mini uggs and kind of like let them hang over and then just wear like a little seamless tank like i'm wearing right now and it just gives you like a really cute outfit and the last store that i bought clothing from is forever 21 and the first items that i got are these seamless tanks that i'm wearing i'm wearing a white one right now but i also got a new black one and these are like the life hack of forever 21 these are the best tank tops in the whole entire world they come in so many different colors and i just feel like they're so affordable and they just fit really well and they're super flattering and they have adjustable straps seamless they go with literally everything so i always just get these and pick them up and then just like replace them when i need to because they're so cheap but i just get the size like small 
maybe it's extra small small and they know they come in medium large but i get the extra small small so i got a white one and then a black one and then the next item i got are these kind of like swooshy mesh pants they're just really oversized they remind me of like img a vibe and i got these in a size medium and they're again just like plain black has little zippers on the sides mesh detailing on the knee and then just go tight at your ankle these are so cool and super chic i just feel like this is really a vibe right now like really Haley baldwin street style-esque if you know what i mean she's like my fashion inspo um but these just like gave me that vibe and they're super cheap and i really love forever 21 for stuff like that like trendy cute affordable pieces and next i picked up two bodysuits from forever 21 and this one actually is an img a dupe i saw the img one on revolve on dote and i was like oh my god i need that but it was back ordered till like march so i found this one on forever 21 and it's just this one shoulder like cut out strappy bodysuit and i got it in a size medium and i washed it and dried it and it really shrunk it fits me really nicely and it was really cute really affordable goes really well with like those black pants i just showed you a pair of high-waisted jeans you can wear it with anything i feel like it's just like super chic and just like really sleek and gives off like a cool vibe and the next bodysuit i got is this bright pink one i honestly wasn't expecting it to be so neon when i ordered it online i thought it was more of like a red color but i really love it and it just has like a little zipper up the front i got it in a size small it's super cheap just a little bodysuit to wear like when you go out Super easy to just pair with anything and honestly the color is so cool I just feel like that really like brings out your tan if you have like fake tan during the winter like I do It just makes your skin look really nice and bronzed and I just feel like having like fun bodysuits are really easy to wear Like when you go out they're one of my favorite things to wear when I go out So I just decided to get this one because it's something different and like different than anything I've ever worn before And for the last few items I got from forever 21 I got these joggers and they're just these heathered gray ones and then a lighter gray color and they're just these drawstring plain joggers these were ten dollars and they're so comfy they go with anything definitely good staples to have i wear them so much i honestly wore them for like two weeks straight when i got them because i was so obsessed with them but they're super affordable just regular old joggers that you can wear with anything and i just think that they're really nice to have forever 21 loki has really really nice joggers if you're not looking to spend like 30 40 dollars at brady melville definitely check out forever 21 i got these in a size medium they get the job done they're super cute they're super cozy and yeah last but not least this last item i got you guys have been obsessing over on my instagram and it is this really cool bomber jacket just this green one with these black buckles all over it and this like orange detailing on the inside i got this in a size medium and i feel like this jacket is so cool and just gives such a vibe i really love it and i just think that it gives off like i don't know i don't know why but it gives me like kim possible vibes it gives off like a really cool chill vibe and you can wear it with like jeans bodysuit anything this jacket alone just dresses up any plain outfit so if you just throw on a pair of jeans and like a plain black bodysuit and a plain black pair of booties and some heels you have yourself a really dope outfit and it was really affordable so if you're looking for a cool jacket to wear out i highly recommend this one and yeah and to end off this haul actually i have a pair of earrings right here that i didn't even notice um i got another pair of hoops from madewell and this is what they look like they're just these really chunky gold hoops i wear these ones also i love them a lot i think they're around 30 dollars, and they also come in like a smaller pair that are like this big just to give you like size reference but those ones are from madewell i love them so 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 much i've been wearing them a ton lately and like kind of switching them out with these ones that i'm wearing right now but to end off this haul i'm going to be showing you guys some skincare and beauty items from sephora that i recently picked up and also blue mercury because these two items i got right here are from blue mercury and i'll actually start off with these ones and i got the la mer moisturizing soft cream and this is just a really high-end moisturizer and i love it it makes my skin so smooth and so hydrating it smells so good it's amazing and i want to try it out it is really expensive but i love it so i've been using this moisturizer lately and i've been using the la mer eye concentrate for like my under eye cream and i just take like the rollerball application apply it underneath my eyes and then i apply my moisturizer over that and that's just what i use to like 
brighten my skin and like make it super glowy and I will be doing like a full skincare routine on my channel so definitely be subscribed so don't, so you don't miss out on that because I've been using a lot of great products lately but these are just two that I recently picked up and next from Sephora I got this mask this mask has been like so hyped up on social media everybody's been talking about it and it is the summer Fridays jet lag mask and what you do is you just open up the top squeeze a little bit on your hand and you can actually put it all over your face and sleep with it but is it is the most hydrating mask ever and now I know why they call it the jet lag mask because after a long flight your skin just feels so dehydrated and like dry and gross but honestly after you put this mask on it like brings it back to life so I'm really excited to try this out when I'm traveling next I really love it and I know they also have like a pumpkin spice one like an exfoliating glowy one which I really want to try out because I love this one and then I picked up another moisturizer from Sephora and it is the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Pink Juice Moisturizer. It smells so good, it smells like watermelon and I have the nighttime like sleeping mask and I use these during the summer so I got this one for like when I'm traveling to warm places in the future. Um, it's just comes in this little glass bottle, super cute, smells just like watermelon, makes your face super smooth and glowy. I really, really like this, I highly recommend it. And also the um, sleeping mask I love also. So this is just like the mini one that I picked up and I love it and it comes with this little like pump on it. And then last for skincare products, I got one of the mini Clinique Take the Day Off Cleansing Balms. This is what I use to take off my makeup, I just, open it up and take some of the product on my hands rub it together and then rub it all over my face and it really just melts your makeup off and then I go in and cleanse my face and do all that after but I just feel like this works so much better than like makeup wipes or something just because I feel like makeup wipes dry out my face and I hate having to like rub my eyes and like rub my skin with it it just makes me feel really like gross and I feel like it honestly like pulls out my eyelashes when I'm like rubbing my eye with the makeup wipe so I just feel like this is very gentle on your skin I really like it for my skin I know some people have messaged me saying that like it doesn't work for them but for me it does and I really like it and it really gets the job done for me so I have like the bigger version of it so I just decided to pick up the little travel size and then next I picked up this Sephora mini solid brush cleaner and I used this last night to clean my brushes and it works wonders and it's just really small and comes with like the soap inside and then this little cleansing pad but this was really cheap oh, I think it was like six dollars it smells like coconuts it smells so good coconuts and like vanilla and yeah it's just like a solid soap thing to clean your brushes because cleaning your brushes is so important you really should do it a lot I don't do mine as often as I should but just definitely to like keep clear skin and keep your skin looking nice not like dirty or like have any bacteria because if you really think about how much you use your makeup brushes then think about putting that on your face it's like really gross so I just would recommend buying something to like clean your brushes with so I've been loving this <sighs> okay and so to end it off I got a bunch of new makeup products and the first one is this Fenty Beauty foundation I've already gone through one tube of this last year but I got it again and I got it in the shade 260 that's my shade I'm wearing it right now but it makes your face look so soft and it feels like nothing on your face. It honestly kind of turns into like a powder consistency once you put it on. But I feel like when you use the Fenty like foundation with the primer, the eye setting stuff, like the contour, um, matchsticks, it just gives you a really nice look. That is literally what I'm wearing right now on my face. I use all the Fenty products and I will be doing a makeup routine if you guys want to see the makeup look that I do like for my videos when I just want a little bit more full coverage in the winter. But I've been loving this product so so much and then i also got another fenty item and it is the fenty beauty universal no not universal it's called the stun stun up lip paint and i got it in the shade uncensored and it's just a really beautiful like a red color and it comes in this really awesome packaging it's like a dagger and it's like really nice liquid red lip and it's matte and I wore it out to dinner with Tyler and I ate with it I drank with it and it honestly stayed in place so I highly recommend this but it is I think like $24 and I just picked up another red lip from Sephora which is the Sephora collection cream lip stain in the shade I think it's called always red I'm pretty sure that's what it's called and this is just what it looks like has little applicator comes in this little tube and I got this one to compare to this one and as you can see the shades are kind of similar but 
This one kind of came off when I was eating. I was eating sushi and drinking water and it came off a little bit. So this one's definitely more like heavy duty, more sturdy, but this one gets the job done. It's a beautiful red. Same as this one. I really like both these products also. And then I also got this Dior show little like travel size sample mascara for 100 points with like my beauty insider card and that's the mascara I'm wearing right now. I just feel like it looks really really nice and gives your eyelashes a lot of volume and also adds like length and definition and I pair it with the Dior lash primer and it just is amazing. I feel like when you use products like from the same company, like the same family, they work really well together. That's just like what I found for myself. So I feel like that Mascara works really well with the Dior Lash Primer that you guys know I love. And last but not least, I got these Stila Glitter on the Go Liquid Eyeshadow Set. And it comes with the shades Rose Gold Retro, Kitten Karma, and Smoldering Satin. And this is just what they all look like. And I can't wait to wear these like during the holiday season just to add like a little pop to my eye look. I actually saw um, my friend Steph wearing these little like eye things during the summer and I was like, oh my God, your eyes are so glittery and like it held up all night and she was like, it's the Stila like liquid glitter eye thing and I've been telling her for the longest time that I'm gonna be trying them out and I'm gonna get them. So I didn't do it until recently and I just picked these up and I cannot wait to wear them. You guys will probably see them in like a makeup look for the holiday season coming up so make sure you are subscribed so you don't wanna miss that. <sighs> and also Sephora gave me a birthday gift and it's the Glam Glow thingy because my birthday is on November 21st. So thank you Sephora, you're so nice. It's the Glow Starter Aluminizing Moisturizer in the Super Mud Mask. But that is all for this haul. <laughs> and if you guys made it all the way to the end, props to you. This was the longest haul in the whole entire world. And yeah, so that concludes everything that I've gotten recently. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I know that you love my hauls. I love making them for you guys. Again, I will have everything linked down below for you if you wanna check it out, if you wanna buy anything. Uh, make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any of my future videos. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for all the support that you give me on all my videos. I need to stop talking because this video is probably so long, but I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.